Hi, Florence. Hi, Miss Willis. Come on in and have some eggnog. Oh, thank you. Hi, everybody. Miss mm. Jefferson, get Miss Willis some eggnog. <laughs> hey, why don't you get it? I can't. I'm coming down with something. <laughs> yeah, a case of the drunks. <laughs> you shouldn't have had so much eggnog, Florence. Yeah, this nutmeg will kill you. <laughs> well, I'm gonna take a little nap. I got a church social to go to tonight, and I'm gonna have to look pretty. Yeah, well, you're gonna have to take a long nap for that. <laughs> Lord, you know I wanna tell him something. But I know you don't want me to talk like that on the day before your birthday. <laughs> oh, Louise. We got some more RSVPs today. The Stones, the Hutchinsons, the McPhersons, and the Millers are all coming to the wedding. I don't know none of them. They're friends of ours. Huh, let me see that list. Where's Rooster Carter? <laughs> I think he still lives in the Bronx. I mean, how come he ain't on his list? You and Rooster haven't seen each other since you had that fight 10 years ago. Well, can you think of a better time to patch things up than at a wedding? <laughs> Bubba Banks ain't on here either. George, I asked you to go over the guest list with me a couple of weeks ago, but you said you were too busy. Yeah, well, I ain't too busy now. I just want to make sure the Willis's ain't inviting just all of their friends. Well, we had to draw the line somewhere. The reception hall only holds so many people. Oh, that reminds me, Louise. We found a band to play at the reception. The leader is a friend of Tom's, and he is a marvelous accordion player. Accordion player? At a wedding reception? You gotta be jiving. <laughs> What's wrong with an accordion? Nothing if you launch well. <laughs> Are you gonna rent a bubble machine, too? Get off it, George. No, you get off it. You can't dance to no accordion music. I want some music you can get down to. <laughs> this is a wedding reception, George, not Soul Train. 